Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com. Happy Tuesday. Coming at you with 2019-2020 Panini Chronicles Hoops. Uh, these are fat pack boxes. Those retail packs, hanger packs, whatever you want to call them. Uh, this is random team break number two with a little bit of an early bird special. Now, and by the way, I know it says no vet comments ship, but like 95% of this break, 97% of this break is probably just inserts. So most everything will ship, just FYI. All right, so first 20 right there. Let's grab the first 20 from Anthony down to Kevin, and let's see who wins that early bird spot. Different dice roll, new list. Let's roll it, randomize it, two and a six, eight times. Name on top gets an extra spot. One, two, three, four. And eighth and final time. Name on top after eight is Anthony. There you go, Anthony. The er I think you were the earliest of birds, were you not? There he is. The earliest of birds has caught the delicious worm. An extra spot for you. There you go. Now let's grab everybody's names again with a new dice roll to assign you a random team. Let's roll it. Let's randomize it. Four and a one, five, time, five times for each list. There you go. There's the list. Five times. Four and a one, five times. One, two, three, four, and a one, fifth and final time. After five times, Douglas down to Kevin. Five times for the teams. And fifth and final time. So after five right here, we've got the Bucks down to the Rockets. The only vet commons that do ship are gonna be uh, second year Luka Doncic's for the Mavs. Giannis for you, Douglas, and the Bucks. LeBron for the Lakers, and if there's any Cavs, LeBron's will go, go, and if there's any Kobe on the check, I don't think there is, but that'll go to you as well. Those are the only guys. All right, Douglas with the Bucks, Alex, Donnelly, you have my Lakers. Jeff with the Celtics, Oliver with the Nuggets, Kevin with the Hornets, Gil with the Suns, Peter, Pelicans, Thomas with the Heat, Sean with the Jazz, uh, Bill with OKC, Last Bond Mojo, Nicholas with the Bulls, Jonathan F with the Sixers, Bill with the Cavs and the Magic, Courtney, you got the Trailblazers, Ryan S with the Clip Show, Andrew with the Speed of the Clip Show, Joe Cook saying you got your Kawhi Mint 10 rookie card today. You're welcome. Congrats on that one again. Oh, that would be Spurs edition, um, but still nice. Peter with the uh, Hawks, Andrew has the Spurs, Anthony with the Nets, Ryan S with the Grizzlies, nice, and the Pistons, Ryan Gomez with the Pacers, Anthony with the Knicks, Courtney with the Mavs, Anthony with your early bird spot, the Timberwolves, Jeff with the Wizards, Douglas with the Warriors, Rick with the Kings, Jeff with the Raptors, and Kevin with the Raw. Oh, and it's San Diego State here. It's pretty cool. I keep forgetting what's San Diego State. All right. So let's uh, alphabetize this by team. I'm going to pause the video. I'm going to go grab the boxes too. And you've got you have an opportunity for trades. Remember, I was just reminded of this in the first break. Prism update in these sets right here, which are super rare, updated Prism, right? So the value is pretty crazy. So trade at your own risk. Let me pause. Why don't we come back? We're going to see if there's any trades. And then the break. Stick around. All right. Welcome back, folks. A lot of trade chatter. A lot of interesting deals being uh, offered as well. But in the end, everyone ended up standing pat like old baseball GM, Pat Gillick. Pat Gillick? Pat, something like that. He's a, he's a Hall of Fame GM. But he's standing Pat. All right. Last spot mojo right there. Early bird spot right there. Thanks everyone. It's a pretty quick break actually, so it's only like only like a 20 minute break. In, in the interest of time, I'm not gonna sleeve everything on camera. I'll, I'll do it after the break itself. I'll only take care of uh, Zions and like that one. Zions and drama rants and, and autographs. But all the other key rookies will set aside and we'll see them up all at once. So they'll be top loaded before they're sorted and shipped out. They'll be safe though until then. Don't worry.
What was your second super fractor? Wow. lot going on in this stuff folks I mean even PJ Washington is worth a hold I think a lot of these players could be worth a hold ladies and gentlemen a lot of people Luka Doncic Kendrick Nunn's right here I mean even Nikhil Alexander's could be interesting Tyler Hero I mean, Darius Garland, DeAndre Hunter has haven't even shown what their true potential could be. So there's a lot of interesting rookies in this particular class. I feel like more so than, than previous classes. I think the 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 restart has given some some rookies an opportunity to to get something going. That's for the Pelicans, that'll be for Peter. There's a lot happening, ladies and gentlemen. In this draft class. Some players may need a little more marinating before they turn into something great. Some people, I mean, some people could be busts. Who knows? Yeah, go, I saw Goga Batadze get some minutes too. That could be interesting. That's right, D-Turg. Yeah, people forget about, I mean, because they didn't really light it up their rookie season, but it's not like they're busts. Don't forget about Jared Culver. Jared Culver for the Timberwolves. That's a top 10 pick. You know, how many first rounders did the Celtics get? Three or four? Romeo Langford, Taco Fall, Carson Edwards. One of those guys has to pan out, right? So this tra this draft class has been has been pretty intriguing. I gotta save these. These are updates. These are pretty rare. These are these prism cards don't show up often, and they're updates. So that goes to the Clippers. That's gonna go to Ryan S. Oh yeah, Tremont Waters, Grant Williams. They've got all. I mean, one of those rookies for the Celtics have to work out, right? And if you're the one who has been holding on to all of those. You know that there there could be there could be a boom there. <clears throat> I saw that Segu Demboya there as well. Right, I mean he's pretty much the only guy on the uh, on the Pistons right now, right? There's Zion Pelicans. That'll be for Peter. There's Seku right here. Jack, I mean, Jared Culver could be interesting. There's Kevin Durant prism for the Nets. Anthony with the Brooklyn Nets. None of these are numbered, Tiggs. None yet. Even the bronze ones, not numbered. I think you'll you'll be able to tell if there's like a, a parallel here. Yeah, a lot of Zions. All of these add up, Peter. Peter and the Pels. Another Zion, this time in a prestige design. And all these different designs have 
varying tiers of value. So I don't know, is the prestige tier is is above the playbook look? I don't know. But I'm sure it's some something that we can discover soon. As more of these gets listed on the secondary market. Ryan S with the Grizz, all these John Morants will go to you. More Zions and John Moran, at least in this small sample size, but it's pretty good. Yeah, the second year Doncic's have been selling surprisingly well. There's Tremont Waters. And these non rookie Giannis's have been selling well. I think the Luminances out of these sets have been doing okay. Or maybe I just like the luminances. I think they look I think they look really sharp. Memphis Grizzlies, Ryan S. John Morant, Luminance design. Excellent photography here too. Who's who's he postering there? Is that Kev, is that Kevin Love right here? Right? <laughs> Sorry, Kevin. Just got it right right in the face. It happens. I, I want them to blow this up into a po they literally should make it into a poster. Did he miss this dunk? Was that the story, Joker? So good play by Kevin Love? Keldon Johnson had like 24 and 11 today. So his stock might be rising. It's the crazy thing with all these cards. Yeah, I've not seen a lot of flux and recon either, Mike Tower. I wonder if they're teasing future products in this. Another John Morant. So we're seeing a little more Jaws now. All right, second box. Yeah, Joe Cook is saying that he, that some, someone look up that video. Joe Cook is is claiming that uh, that John Moran missed that dunk. <laughs> Jarrell, did you get did you get Keldon Johnson's autograph on that redemption? As suggested, did you tell Keldon to like sign sign your cards, buddy? He did miss the dunk. Ref is saying, uh, "What could have been?" Kel Keldon Johnson had a nice game today, Terrell. Did I see twenty four and eleven on that? Is that is Chronicles three already sold out? There'll be a Chronicles four. I don't think there'll be any more after that. Wow, yeah, three sold out. So, yeah, I think we'll have one more going up after this break, after I'm done with this. Portland's up 66-58 on the Mavs. Second half coming up. Is it halfway to 50? I got 25 points in the first half. I am so scared of the uh, Trailblazers in the playoffs against my Lakers. Yeah, number four will be the last one, Daniel. 
Number three coming up a little bit later. Probably right after this. Yeah, I can never win. There he is. He had a nice game today, Mr. Kelvin Johnson. Today? Yesterday? Today, I think. Nice. We'll get that up, Tracy. We'll get that next one up. Kind of in the middle of something right now. Kendrick, lots of people right here. Zion, Kevin Porter Jr. could be an interesting player. There's a lot, lot of, lot of upside for a lot of these players. I feel like this year, more so, more so than in previous years. more Zions and then a John Morant That a, I think that might be a bronze background on this John Morant Recon. Um, Ryan, Ryan? Yeah, Ryan S. Which I think is exclusive to this set. Looks like it. It's kind of hard to tell in the light. Yeah. I think it is. Different designs of these cards make these cards so slippery. All right, We've got a group of John Morants here now. A couple more Zions. And a couple Zions. So you can see there's this. You can see the differences in the. Uh, in the parallels here, I'll show you an example. So these are two Playbook Zion cards. The left one right there is going to be bronze, and then the right one is just the regular one. You can see the difference already right there. Uh, I, did, did we not see a single bowl bowl card? There has to be at least one hiding in there somewhere, Oliver. And there's the final John Morant marquee. 
And there you go, ladies and gentlemen. Another two-box break coming up. Another two-box break will be posted. I don't know if we're going to have much more after that. I'll have to double-check the stock in the back. But I'm Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com. Thanks for watching. There will be more. Check it out.